Sharmin Khan from Milky Way Art Design. So today we are going to work on a triptych and each uh, canvas is 24 by 36 inch in dimension. And the colors that we are using, let's go through them first. The first color that you see it's green yellow from Artists Loft. The second color that we have, I don't remember the exact, oops I threw away the the uh, container it's from liquitex i think some kind of green this one that one is turquoise no this one is taylor green from um liquitex basics this is prussian blue from golden this is white uh, from artist love um soft body and i mixed um farin enamel from uh deco art in this one this one is 24k gold take from deco art turquoise from golden this one is cerulean blue from golden this one is viridian from master's tap touch and the last one is called Oceans Green from Master's Touch. So these are my colors that I have today. First, what I'm going to do is I am going to brush my portion of the canvas with paints gray paints gray and then I am going to pour a um, straight pour kind of like galaxy pour on top of that um, canvas but it's not going to be covering the entire canvas so let, let's first layer our um, paint in the center I want it to be blue so I'm going to start with the lightest of the blue shade and gradually I will go darker I'm going to use just a teensy bit of gold so I will then repeat the same pattern again. So it's a 16 ounce cup, completely full. I'm going to remove all my paints to the side.
so I have colored using a brush this side with paints gray I'm going to pour on here oops I'm gonna wipe it later don't worry here's the thing I want to add some gold which I could not because my cup was too full so I dispersed a little now I'm going to fill it up and the way I poured the gold is I'm just going to drop it inside let's do it okay so this is what we have now I'm going to use some artist loft white as a flow extender along with deco art satin enamel i also have some gold here so let's start Thank you. 
so this is the close-up that I have and look at the composition that I did and it's going to be vertical sorry so it's going to look like this this is how it should look like let's see if we can break this up a little I'm going to dip it in the gold and looks really pretty and I'm gonna stop Alisha someone needs to come here yeah. last part it a transport go okay let me wash my hands I Now that my first one is done, I have to do it uh, two more times because this is a set of triptych. This is the second one and same way I filled up the cup.
Let's torch it a little. I want to break this gold a little. Here I'm creating some fake blue cells. Let me remove it. This is the third piece and for this one I ran out of paint gray. So what I'm gonna do, I will make my board then I will tape this side and color on the other side. So, bear with me.
just breaking up the solid blue there a little with gold I'm just adding some fake golden uh, cells because I wanted some cells there and it did not develop. So um, I am just putting some little dots there. Once my paints dried, I went back and I did another touch of uh, paints gray uh, using foam brush and I brushed the other side of my canvas. After that, I used resin to resin my pouring side, but I left the other side alone. And also I put a golden resin border where the two sides met and I slanted my uh, canvas a little so I can have some drips going down of the golden uh, paints of the on the canvas. I'm sorry I could not record the part where I used my resin and everything because I resin at my garage and there is not enough space there to record myself. I hope you liked this video and thank you for joining me today.